What's up, Radar Force? It's Dragon Radar here with a new type of video today. Today I will be constructing the Final Form Frieza model kit thingamabob. I'm gonna be constructing it, and yeah, this is probably gonna take me forever. Probably not gonna finish it today, but I'm gonna try to get as much as I can done. But yeah, you guys are gonna see the entire progress of me building this. But I'm gonna be doing time lapses throughout this the making of this so let's go ahead and get started uh as you can see there's the final form frieza and all of his poses type deals you can do with it you know so we have the instructions which i'm going to need very dearly some more like instructions and all of the parts we need to build it which is a lot. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Um, so you guys are about to see a uh, time lapse until whenever I decide to talk again. So let's get started on building this. So time lapse time. Okay guys, I have completed Frieza, everything is done on him, uh, his second face, which he has two faces, and now I'm, I'm going to assemble the weapons and whatnot, but I'm not going to do a time lapse on these, I'm just going to make them right fast and then I'll get back to you, so be right back. Okay guys, I built the death ball, uh, the death beam, got his extra hands you can replace with. Um, I have and one he points with. I'm not sure how I want to display them, but I will use the displays for every uh, how they do it in here. I'll, I'll show you what they look like. So I'll get back to you when I have that set up. All right, that is one of the poses with the death ball. That's pretty sick. You can move it around however you like and anything like that pretty cool now I'm gonna do the death beam I guess which is right here actually I'll do another death ball there's two versions of the death ball actually I don't think I can do this because I don't have this doesn't come with the action stand you can't stand them up but I'll show you what it would look like they had him like doing this I don't know if you guys can see that in the, in the picture they had him like this but see, it, the, the stand that holds them comes separately. So it would look something like that. But yeah, they had a stand that they have a stand that hooks to his tail, but it, it's sold separately. And that's how that would look like. And now the death beam. They also have one with the open palms like this. The open palms like that, where you can like he can hold the death ball up, which is cool too. But I'm not gonna show that because I don't have the action stand. I think I'm going to display him with the death beam though, because that is my favorite. I never really cared for the death ball. There is the death beam. There are many different poses you can make with this, so the sky's the limit with that. But uh, yeah, this is a pretty awesome set. I, I bought another one, which I'll do on episode two of this, or if I do this a series. But yeah, I'm going to do have another one of these very soon. But uh. Yeah, that is Frieza. It took about two hours to make, so not too terribly bad. The hardest part were the stickers, putting the stickers on the toes, the ears, and I think there's one other place I forgot where I put a sticker at, but uh, pretty annoying. It's so tiny, but I do like the death beam. It's kind of lame that it didn't come with like the action stand to hold them up. Like you could have a stand that holds them up, and you can he could like show them flying and doing stuff, such as like this. See as you sell right there. He's flying. 
that's kind of how I made mine right there. The death ball. You can see the action stand somewhere, like right here. All the actions. But yeah, there's all the actions. But yeah, uh, if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. You guys take care. Peace.